rest of that to retain it. And I... Coming in the soothing, yeah? Yes. Station I'm going to stop at. Next station, Subiaco. I don't think I've ever seen Subiaco without a person. Yeah. Oh, too far, sorry. Yeah, sorry. It's a busy platform. Mm. It doesn't say they're non stop, anyways. Non stop, too. How come it doesn't say that? Um, should have. Fair enough. Because since we got to Claremont, it's never said they're non stop, too, like Subiaco and whatnot. And just then, as you can hear. Next station, City West. Well, from the Subiaco as well, I wouldn't say that either, so it's. station City West. This is this is City West.
Next station, Perth. Next station, Perth. You're under Yagen Square now. Fair enough. That's pretty good actually, under Yagen Square. Oh. I know, but that's what the speed gauge is telling me to do, so... Which platform am I going to use? Uh, you'll be going to... Where are we? 7, 8. Fair enough. It's been a while. <laughs> Fair enough. Yeah. There is a 9 though, isn't there? Yeah, yeah. there's a 9. That's another one. Yeah. Yeah, the we use that for special to. events. Yeah, showground normally. Oh, platform 9 instead. Yeah. yeah. This is Perth. It doesn't even say please mind the gap either. Next what? station, Perth. But that's, that's only been invented. Last 18 months or something. What's that? that? When they say mind the step, please mind the step. Um, yeah, that's this if the drivers, if all the gaps are spot on. Yeah. Yeah, uh, they're, um, the steps are just an inch gap. And yeah, yeah. There's no platforms. We win awards for Australia wide. Wow. Australian awards. We win them every year for what we do. Wow. Because all our trains are perfectly flat. Yep. Steps are level with the platform everywhere. Wow. They spend okay. millions doing it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I know in Germany there's a gap, there's definitely a gap in there. Oh, go over east, you gotta step off and drop right down a foot. Wow. On their trains and, yeah, no, we, uh, you know, with all the wheelchair access, everything, uh, we win awards every year for it. Wow. And that's for Australian railways. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, uh, the um, government's put a lot into it. Mm. So they check these, everything, they got a certain ride height. We've got a suspension system it underneath. Perfect. We'll make some you know, wow. drivers, if they see it's dropped lower than the platform, they've got to report it and they'll be checked. Wow. Load leveling device underneath they've got. Yeah, yeah. So as people get on and they're fully loaded, the airbags compensate and bring it up to that level. Oh my God. Mm. Make sure it rides at that level all the time. When they get off, you hear them exhaust in the air as people yeah. are getting off. That's the load levelling device uh, airing out the airbags because the weight's coming out of it. Wow. So it'll um, bring it, down yeah, it brings it back down to its um, right. oh, ride height. Up, yeah. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, wow. uh, you might see them when they pull up and they rise, raise up a look about an inch or something and yeah. they'll, they'll sit back down again wow. and you hear it exhaust in the air. Alright, what's wrong? Can't seem to get yeah. the mm. up, I mean Midlands up. I'm yeah, to do, Fremantle to Midland it was. I'm trying to do Perth to Midland B pattern, and it's not going to make the announcement, so it's... Um, uh, here you go. Oh, there we are. Yeah. This train runs from Perth to Midland, stopping at all stations to Bayswater, then Bassendean and Midland. Come on, driver, you're behind time. Why are you late? Yes. That's what this the controller will be saying. Yes. Why haven't you left? Stopping at all stations today. Because. You've got already two minutes over. Yeah. No one getting on. No, that's true. That's better, anyways. I can go down Midland now. So I've got to do no more than 35 now, folks. That's great. Mm. Next station, MacIver.
thought it was 30 on these parts. Yeah, even the braking system compensates for the weight too. Mm. All computer control. Fair enough. It's, what is it? So it's about um, it's 15, 15 people to a ton, I think it is. Oh yeah, so it's calculated. You know, a six car set will hold 1,100 people. Next station, Hakaiba. Mm. That's pretty good. So you're moving every six car set in the peak? Yeah. You know what's on it? Yeah. 1,100 Eleven. passengers. Mm. And do they does the driver know if it's over full? It's no, no, you just cram them in. <laughs> That's what they est estimated at 1,100. You know, they do some head counts. Yeah. He's stand at the door. And, uh, okay. I reckon I've put more than that in them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Squeeze them in like sardines. Football, man. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> especially when they all want to go home. You yeah. get as many as you can. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, look at India, they. Yeah, they're riding right the, the roofs. Roof. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's hanging off the bloody doors. Yeah, they're crazy over there. Yeah, yeah. I've got a few Indian drivers here, and what they tell you, they don't stop, they're not allowed to. They hit bridges, you hear boop, boop, hit bridges. And Next station, oh, yeah, They run them over, and oh, no. something like 30,000 a year or something. It's a oh, phenomenal station. amount. Really? <laughs> they just keep going, call it in, the cops come and pick it up. Because uh, they said it's tribal. Um, if you're in the wrong, they'll kill you. What's doing this? Wow. Um, what's going on? Oh, what's happening? Yeah, Want to go? Pardon? Want to go? It's nice. Yeah, that's nice. 10, 10 k's an hour, that. Fair enough. Yep, so do 10 k's an hour. Fair enough. Until you get it, it updates itself. Fair enough. So you, no, no, you go, you're going too fast, yeah. Fair enough. Press the button again. Yeah. See what happens now. Yep, 35. All right. Something going wrong there. Yeah, fair enough. Another glitch Next in the station, system. Please book. All right, stay at 35 to those double zeros go. Yep. See on the left. In the left there, it's got double zero. Yes. That means you can do 40. Yes. Yeah, you're over speeding now. 35. Yes, so, 250. Well, that's not updating. Mm. So, what are you thinking of giving me for work experience, anyways? Work experience? Yes. What a grade. Yeah. <laughs> Hey? I don't know. I'll give you a 90 out of 100 there. Right? <laughs> Fair enough. Hey, you're well, doing because well. you're missing your lunch or something. <laughs> oh. <laughs> hey? It's because you're missing your lunch or something. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Afternoon tea. Yeah. Afternoon tea. Sorry. Missing me brew. Yeah. <laughs> I've actually never really seen inside the tunnel. Claysbrook to East Perth Tunnel. This is Claysbrook. That was our first tunnel. Was it? Fair enough. That would have been a big deal in those times. Wow, well, it was. Nice. <laughs> oh. Now they're everywhere. Yeah. Go down the Mandra Way. Got tunnels everywhere. Yeah, and I trek the London Underground. You see how many are there? Got back in my day. Um, we might be similar. I don't know. <laughs> but back in my day, I can remember the last train. Oh, yeah. Going yeah. Through Perth, yeah. yeah. Uh, it's going Shit, back I remember the steamers. Yeah, yeah. I was a little kid. Yeah. Grew up in the 60s. Oh, did you? I was 50s. 50s, yeah. Uh, born 1950. Yeah. Oh, 1950, yeah. yeah. Okay. 68, yeah. Okay. Well, I'm 10 years younger. <laughs> he's, he's my oldest. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah, I got a 14 year old. 15 year old. Start late, did you? <laughs> oh, yeah, 50 when I had my first child. Yeah, yeah, yeah Literally. Okay. Never thought I'd ever have children. Yeah, 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 okay. I've never seen this exactly like this, never even gone off when it looked like this. Oh, this, this is all different. This has I got know. to be changed. I know. Yeah, yes. They revamped that for the footy? Yeah, I know, I heard. Yeah, I, uh, I was on a Catholic orphanage as a kid, the council there. And oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, this is East. I never thought I'd. I'd have kids because I was too worried about it. Yeah, yeah, okay. And, and I, uh, I 
gave evidence at the Royal Commission, so that's... Ah, yeah, good on you. Yeah. You, feel good, you feel a lot better. Yeah, you get a load off, yeah. yeah. Uh, the bastards that do. Uh, they uh, were, they were. They've got a lot to account for, those people. Yeah. Next station, Mount Norley. The worst one of the lot is um, how... They should the string him up. Yeah. yeah, he's the worst of the lot. Yep. You know? He's covered up everything, Yeah. You know? Wouldn't be surprised if he's part of it all. Oh, he is. He yeah. is. They, they, they've got people that have. How can you cover it up and not be part of it? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. No? Yeah. They drive me nuts. Actually, I shouldn't say much. We're getting recorded here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was just about to mention that, actually. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, I remember the, one of the brothers in particular he used to come into the dormitory at night time and you'd see him in the silhouette of the showers. Yeah. The light on all the time in the showers, yeah. and go and look the toilet and stuff, you know. And he'd stand there and just quite which kid he's going to have tonight. Just Next like, station, yeah. 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 and I'd see it, you know. It, it was embedded in my mind, you yeah. know. And I was nine years of age. Yeah, you wouldn't eight. forget stuff like that. No. No. Who would, anyways? Horrible people. And then, you, then you know, when I first, when I first saw it, why are these kids special? Why are they taking them all that? Yeah. I thought that was a special thing, you know? Yeah, yeah. Aren't you glad now? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know? Nah, it's rotten. Yeah. And hopefully they're all in hell. Oh, yeah. Yeah, if, there's a, if there is a hell, they'll be there for yeah. sure. Yeah. This is Mount Morley. Doesn't even say this please me on the gap, does it? Yeah, this one's got a little bit of gaps, but it's, mm. it's unfortunate. Platforms on curves don't work. No, fair enough. No. And they seem to be going away from it now, mm -hmm. which is good. Next station, Maylands. Yeah, what gets me is the church has only just um, kicked him out, you know, and removed him from his position. Yeah. All that time. Yep. They took, they took him out of Australia over right, the years yeah. to try and protect him, yeah. but it didn't work. Nah. They got him back. You know? Yeah. And I hope he suffers and I hope he gets what he's deserved. But you're right though, I can understand what you guys were going through. I feel like I'm going through the same way as my father sometimes. <laughs> yes, mate. <laughs> yes, Dad. Uh, nothing like that, mate, I can assure you. Yes, Dad. <laughs> Next station, Maylands. Yeah, I, I walked into a place in, in Fremantle called Chalk Place where people, now, I now know that people go there who have been in institutions. Yeah, and yeah. It's a drop-in place where they can have a meal and, and all yeah. the rest of it. Yeah, you know. talk, and, yeah. And I walked in there and, and I, the first bloke I saw, I thought, God, I don't know you. And I walked up and started talking. And I, and he goes, yeah, you're familiar to me too. He said, where were you? And I said, oh, Castle there. He goes, what year? He goes, that's it. We're there together. Yeah. Same year. You know, Amazing. We're there together. Catch up after all those and years. All those years and I saw him mm. and knew him straight away. You know. It's just amazing, you know. It's yeah. a small world, isn't it? And you see photos of him when he was a kid. Don't look anything like he is now. Yeah, But yeah. I still knew him. Yeah, it's you know, amazing how you just, don't forget. Mm. Yeah. This is Maylands. So, and the head brother at Castle Dare, yes, the head brother, was a cousin of mine. Yeah. And that's just, that's just, over the years I've had to digest that and understand wow. how he would let Next that go on. Yeah. 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 He was a folder, I don't know if you've heard of the foldies, the footballers. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. He was a folder. Okay. They my relatives. Yeah, yeah. Well, we're coming up to 90 now, so... It's and they are they were priests and, and Christian brothers and fathers. Very religious family. But, you know, how can you put that down to religion, you know? That's what I mean, uh, yeah. they preach all that and yet <laughs> do the worst atrocities of the world. Yeah. yeah. And the church has yeah. over the years, yeah. centuries. Yeah, yeah. The, the torturing that's been going on in, in the Vatican and places yeah. over the years, you know, yeah. just... How much they hide? Yeah, it's basically same with. We aliens. probably don't know anything of what they really do. That much, yeah. I reckon we know. That yeah. Much. Yeah. What are they doing in these third world countries and that? Yeah. 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 
next station. You reckon they're Milton. helping people? Yeah. We're going to go to um, New Children's Hospital next week sometime. Oh, okay. This week sometime, sorry. Yeah. Um, my, um, my mate, she, she's their godmother. Yeah. Right. And she's she lives in New South Wales. She married a Milton. rich farmer over there. Oh yeah. And she's been sending gifts over for you know ever since you know yeah. birthdays, Christmas, Easter, all of it. You know. And you know they the, they got farms in well her, their relatives. He's a Wagga, Newcastle, all oh, those yeah, places. Yeah. You know. And um, each year they go to a different next station, uh, Bayswater, city in in New South Wales. Yep. Yeah. You know. Um, and one, one year they were sitting there and she was talking to Phil, which is her husband, you know, and they would come up with a suggestion with themselves, you know, um, because the kids at, at that, that particular year got 13 presents each. Yeah. Right? And she said, that's just ludicrous, you know, how any kid, you know, this is just at the presentation, you know, from the different relatives. And yeah, the, you know, okay. And she goes, well, they talked it over and then the next thing she made next the announcement, she said, oh, how would you feel if we went to the local hospital this afternoon and each child gave one of their presents back to give to one of the other children? Yeah, yeah. You know, at the hospital. Oh, her, her name, next she said station, her name was like Bayswater. mud. Oh, Absolute yeah. Absolute mud. They just said that was disgusting to think, how can you take a present off a child that you've just given it to, you know? So, I, I said, well, why don't you send the presents over to my kids and we'll take it to the yeah. children's hospital. I said, because we've talked about it for a couple of years. Yeah, yeah. His, his his bought her. So she sent them over and they were, the presents that she bought, she bought three presents for the three boys, yeah. which are going to be given to them. You know, and they were made in third world countries. This lady goes over this and buys all these oh, yeah. beautiful things that are made in third world countries. You know, like yeah, yeah. rag dolls and all that sort of stuff. But, you know... So she's brought them off this lady, right? yeah. and she said she bought this elephant. I haven't even opened it because I wanted to give it to the hospital unopened yeah. so they know that it's fresh, you know. Yep. Yeah. And she said the elephant is worth well, ten times the amount she paid for it because Bassinger. she'd been using it, had caking it around for two years in a row, and no one had bought it because it was too big. Yeah, you know? yeah. So that's one of the, the gifts that she's doing. Well, but I miss what this place used to look when like. I rang, when I rang the hospital and organised the guy, you know, he said to me, just ring up the day before that you, you're going to come in and I'll organise to meet you and, and get the kids to take photos and stuff. Yeah, yeah. So that then I can send the photos by phone to her. Oh, okay. So on the day, she's going to show everybody the photos yeah. of her godchildren giving their presents that yeah. she'd sent to me. Oh, good. She said, I'll get them back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> can the PA people hear me, please? So that's amazing, though. Yeah. They're getting so much. Yeah. Why well, wouldn't you teach your kids that? That's right. I miss what this place used to look like. Yeah. Especially said, when they're getting so much. Yeah. And they're, they're wealthy people. They're yeah. all wealthy farmers, you know. And she said that it, she just sort of just, it just reeked of, of you know. Yeah. Yeah. No right from wrong. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Yeah, people like that. She said it's like greed. You know, it's yeah. just like greed. But it's probably not the kids. If they ran it past the kids, the kids are probably like, oh, yeah, 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 well, yeah, why yeah, not? Yeah, that's right. Because the kids yeah. are spontaneous. They don't look at nah, you know, nah. and, how and, you know, like, what they're missing out on or anything. Well, my kids were little. They got lots of presents. Mm. Lots of presents, you know. But they'd give them away to other people. Yeah. You know, because if they, once they've had a look at them and if they, it didn't suit them, they'd give them to somebody else. Yeah. You know, rather than just keep it for the sake of keeping it. Yeah, no, that's good. Yeah. yeah.